morning so I am putting some chicken to marinate so I'm doing the marinade so I'm going to put in uh, maybe quarter cup of olive oil juice from a lemon seeds from a lemon no Then I'm just going to, oh, more seeds. Then I'm just going to put in some seasoning. So I have Old Bay. So I'm going to put in maybe about a teaspoon of that. And I have the Slovaki. These are epic here. Maybe about a teaspoon of that. And minced onion, which is also epic here rosemary garlic each of these I'm putting about a teaspoon and just actual garlic and a bit of salt so a pinch of salt and to that I have three chicken breasts that I'm going to make for dinner so I'm just going to Rub that all in. And I'm going to cover it, put it back in the fridge, and I will leave it until supper time. So I'm finishing off the chicken that I made earlier, I put to marinate. So I sliced the chicken breast, so just take the chicken breast, a fairly sharp knife, I don't really have any super sharp knives, but so like so. And I'm going to, I have this, uh, it's uh, herb and spice. It's a uh, cream cheese. So I want to use some of that. So I'm going to put that in there. Squish it down. And I'm going to put one slice of Swiss cheese. And then fold this over. And on the outside of the chicken, I want to coat it. So in order to uh, put the breadcrumbs, instead of egg, I'm using mayonnaise. So. With this, I'm not using much in the way of utensils because I don't want to cross-contaminate. That's why I used my hands to put this stuff on. Then, once it's coated well on both sides, I'm putting it on a parchment-lined paper. I got the oven preheating to 375. Probably take about a half an hour. Just make sure that uh, there's no pink. And that's it for my chicken. So here's the finished chicken with last night's spinach feta pie.